Hey, today we're going to review a great new product from Lutron. It's called Caseta Wireless, and we're going to talk about uh, the Smart Bridge Pro, which is the piece that allows you to connect all your lighting control and thermostats uh, to your phone. So you can control lighting, shades, temperature, all from your iPhone or other iOS devices or Android devices. This is the Smart Bridge Pro, and it has the ability to connect and control your dimmers and shades and thermostats but it also allows you to integrate with third-party products. So you can control it from uh, remote controls like the Pro Control or R RTI remote. So you can use your TV remote to adjust your blinds, your lighting. Uh, you can also use it to integrate to security systems, which is a really neat feature because you can integrate it and have your lights turn on if your alarm goes off or have your lights turn off when you arm your alarm system. So this is the Smart Bridge Pro. And then there's also this regular Smart Bridge which looks identical, but it doesn't have all the features to control with third-party remotes or integrate into alarm systems. Uh, so they do a lot of the same things, and today we're just gonna set one up and see how it goes. Okay, so here's the Smart Bridge Pro. In the box, it'll come with a power cord and an ethernet cable. So we need to plug it into our router and into power. So I'm gonna just grab the power cord. I've already plugged it into the surge protection. And this is actually a mini or a micro USB port that we'll just plug in. So we'll just go ahead and plug that in. And we'll plug in the ethernet cable to the back. It's just a standard Cat5, Cat6 cable. So now we'll download the app from the App Store on our iPod. So we'll open that up. And we'll do a search. And we can just type in uh, Lutron or Caseta. I'm gonna type in Caseta. And you get Lutron app for Caseta Wireless. That's what you want. You want to go ahead and hit download. It'll download it to your device. And I'm going to just go ahead and open it up on my device here under Lutron. So we're going to open that up. We'll open it up. We're going to do set up my system. We'll go through these steps. So we're going to create an account. So we'll tap on, type in our email address. and a password. I'm going to tap on sign up. Alright, so we're going to do that. So we're going to authorize the SmartBridge application to use our account. So that's our Lutron account. We're going to plug it in. We've already done that. So we'll just tap on next. And we've plugged it into power. Next. So now it's discovering our SmartBridge. And again, this is the SmartBridge Pro, so it allows us to connect to third-party remote control systems like uh, Pro Control or RTI. That would allow us to control our lighting uh, via a remote control for our TV as well um, as our, our, our dimmers, our lighting, our shades, and our thermostat. Uh, the SmartBridge, uh, the SmartBridge Pro's little brother, allows us to control our lighting and everything from our iPhone, but it doesn't integrate into third-party uh, remotes or security systems. So let's go ahead and tap on this little button. So I'm going to turn it around so you can see it. So I'm just going to press that button right here to activate it. You just give it a good solid press. And it'll just take a couple seconds and then the Smart Bridge app will recognize it here. Okay, so now it's finishing the setup. And so now we can set our time and location. You want to make sure you do this because you can set schedules to run based on time of day, but also based on events like sunset or sunrise. So you want to make sure your location is correct so the sunrise and sunset are correct in the system. And one of the neat things about having a lighting control system in your house is that you can set these based on sunrise or sunset. So you can have lights turn on or off um, at sunrise or sunset. So at night, you don't have to set turn off at 6 o'clock, but you can say turn off 20 minutes after sunset or you have your shades close 20 minutes after sunset and that because sunset changes every day you don't want to set an exact time because then they'll be closing at the wrong time for half the year all right so now that it's activated my uh, smart bridge pro i can now start adding devices and what we're going to do is we're going to add devices in another video so i hope you enjoyed it and we'll be back soon thanks